Well, what do we have here? Welcome to Rockford's Funhouse. Look, look at there, you caught me with my freaking fly open. <laughs> what are you looking at? I don't know, we got that situated. Let me introduce you to a good friend of mine. I'm Rockford, and this is Rockford Jr. Here at Rockford's Funhouse, we'll give you guys a scare. Well, we'll try to. How you guys doing today? Anything to say, buddy? Oh, okay, okay. Well, here at Rockford's Funhouse, I would like to give you a piece of advice. If you have anybody that think they're better than you, you tell them, hey, buddy, we roll our sleeves up the same way. You're no better than me. It's Halloween. Let's tell a spooky story. Well, it goes like this. My mom and her husband, they went on a date and they left me alone at home by myself. Rocky, be in your room, sleep at 10 p.m. Yes, ma'am, I oblige. We'll be back. I'll call you before we get there. It's 9.59. I'm in my room. I'm playing the game. Mind clear. I'm focused on what I'm doing. 10 p.m. arrives. A cold draft drift past my door. I can see the silhouette of feet at the bottom of my door. Rocky, are you asleep, son? Yes, ma'am. I didn't think anything of it. I was playing the game. Online with my friends having a good time. Yes, ma'am. I'm going to sleep as soon as this game is done. You wouldn't believe what happened next. I heard the footsteps casually go down. I get a phone call. You didn't believe who it was. Hello? Mom? Hey Rocky, we're on the way home. Did you need anything? Hello? Hey Rocky, we're on the way home. Did you need anything? We're on the way home. We're on the way home. Did you need anything? Ooh. Was at the door. I stayed in my room and I didn't come out until the next morning. What was in that house with me? Just put that into your head. Who was at the freaking door? That's for today's episode of Rockford's Fun House. Thank you guys for joining me. And...